Well, today I thought we uh, would have a quick look at what you can do to avoid thermal bridging uh, in residential construction, particularly when you're incorporating structural steel into a wood frame building. So let's go have a look at uh, detail that the RDC crew has done here that uh, really effectively takes care of that thermal bridging when you're using steel. As you can see, this is a new ridge beam that's going on to an existing residence. Uh, to extend the front of the building out and due to the loads uh, we were unable to use a wood framed timber here and so it's been replaced with steel but as you might notice where the beam sits on that post the steel terminates and the overhang is carried uh, on a laminated wood portion and so by making sure that none of the steel extends beyond the building envelope we have eliminated any thermal, thermal bridging concerns uh, which could result in condensation buildup around that element inside the house in winter. And here you have a bit of a closer up detail where you can clearly see the steel stays with inside the heated envelope and the extension to carry the roof overhang is all wood framed.